Hi friends, scooch on in for our special time together today. I want to tell you a story about when I was little. I think I was probably about in the third grade. I was playing at a friend's house and um, I was, we were playing tag and I ran around a tree and the tree had some really knobbly bark on it. And I, as I ran around it, my leg hit it, my shin, um, so the front part of my leg, and it scraped some skin off, like just a couple of weird layers. It wasn't like I got a line, it was just a little scrape. Well, I can't tell you why, but for some bizarre reason, I, I was afraid I was gonna get in trouble. Now, let me tell you, my mom embraced me and wanted to know how she could help me. But for whatever reason, I thought I was gonna get in trouble. So when I went home, I went straight to my room and hid. And then it was almost time for dinner. My mom was making dinner and I went to the kitchen and I hid behind the counter. And then I said, mom, I need to tell you something, but you have to promise you won't be mad. <laughs> I built it up into this really big thing. And really my mom wanted to know I was okay. So I told her about how I scraped my leg on this tree. And you know what? I have a scar there even today. And if I had actually gone to my mom and shown it to her when it happened, it may have been that we could have taken a little bit better care of it right when it happened um, so that I wouldn't have such a big scar. But I didn't go see her and like four hours later, I was finally telling her about it. I didn't get in trouble. My mom embraced me and wanted to know how to help and was sad that I was hurt. It makes me think about God's great love for us. God is so proud when we tell God such wonderful things that are happening in our lives. But God also loves us really big when we say, oh, God, I messed up. I didn't get this right and I'm not proud of it. And I bet you're not proud of it either. Can you forgive me? God loves us so much, so much more than we can even imagine. And God is always waiting to hear from us the good things and the bad things and the hard things. I want you to remember that you can always go, always go to God and tell God anything. Tell God how you're feeling. Tell God what you're thinking. Tell God what you did. All of those things can be good or bad or difficult or wonderful. God wants to know all of you. And that goes for forgiveness too. When we go to God and say, here's what I did and it's not okay and I'm sorry, God, will you forgive me? God is waiting to embrace you. Let's give you a giant hug and say, I love you because I made you and I want to know you more, and I want you to know me too. So will you remember that? That we can tell God all about our lives, and God loves us. So let's share the good and the bad. God loves you. Let's pray together. Gracious God, thank you for who you are and how you love us. Thank you for making us and thank you for wanting to know all of us. The great things, the hard things, the bad things, the things we're embarrassed about that we don't want to share, and the things that we want to celebrate. Help us to come to you with everything that's going on in our lives. And if it's something that we're not proud of, help us to ask you for forgiveness because we know that you offer it so well. God, thank you for your great big love for us all the time. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Thanks, friends. See you next time.